Hello, welcome back to Algebra 1. Here we're going to learn about evaluating numerical expressions. Don't let this title uh, confuse you or scare you. It's a very simple concept and we're going to get to it here in just a second. Um, so first let's talk about what is a numerical expression. Okay. Expression, this word expression, you see, you're going to see it in algebra all the time. Basically, an expression is math operations. So a numerical expression is math operations that have numbers. Okay, because in later on we're going to have math operations involving letters, variables. So this means, for instance, uh, you're, you, you have uh, uh, math operations with things like addition, subtraction, uh, multiplication, and division. Right, so those are the main math operations. And in fact, later on we're going to talk about exponents and square roots and all kinds of other things. So those can all be a part of expressions as well. But for now, numerical expressions just means adding, subtracting, multiplying, and dividing numbers essentially is all it means when you have a numerical expression. Later on we'll talk about algebraic expressions when you're doing all of these things to variables, letters. So it's, it's a real simple concept. You've been doing this since third grade. But one thing I want to caution you, and I've mentioned a couple of times, uh, I use the letter X here for multiplication to show you that we can multiply in expressions, but we never write the letter X for multiplication to, to intend to, to show multiplication in algebra because it gets confusing. We use the variable X all of the time. So for instance, in basic math, you might say three times four. Right? This means 3 times 4 is equal to 12, obviously. But you see the x here in algebra is going to look like a variable. It looks like 3 times x times 4. So we, we never use this x to mean multiplication. Instead, in algebra, we, and I've done this several times, we put 3 and then a dot here uh, with a 4. That means